Hotep, Hotep, Masha and the Watcher. Happy Akoma Day. Happy Akoma Day, 11th annual. Um, it's been a run. It's been a long run. Um, <laughs> but we're just getting started. Um, we're in nine, ten countries and growing. And so, of course, this year we wanted to be more personal and share a, a lot more of ourselves and the story. Um, so, a lot of times when we're out there and we're doing stuff with Acoma Day or with Acoma House Initiative, a lot of people ask us, you know, you guys do this stuff, you do this relationship stuff, this family stuff. How did you actually meet? How did you come together? Um, it's a funny story. Um, <laughs> we actually met at a car wash. So, shout out to my little sister, Devin. We went to wash our cars one early evening in a... Uh, a winter, a late winter, kind of right. like this, mm -hmm. and we didn't have any paper towels, <laughs> so we made a deal that if I asked for them, she would return them, because of course we didn't want some strange man thinking we were trying <laughs> to pick them up. You so know, Masho, um, <laughs> he wrote a poem about how we met and actually how our love grew from that point, and it's actually grown so much that it includes our whole relationship now. So we do this poem, Mancho does the poem, every year at our, our Acoma Day celebration, and this year we wanted to share it with you. Okay, and the piece is called Towering Star, and the reason it's called Towering Star is a lot, um, she was just really tall, and she was a star. <laughs> um, that's the basic understanding of it, but um, here it goes. Interpret me. Because I met a towering star. I mean a glorious star, a beautiful star. Interpret me. Because I met this towering star inadvertently as I showered my car. I said, damn, how tall are you? She said, whatever. I said, man, how fine are you? She said, that's clever. I said, well, what about your man? She went, hmm, whatever. Her last name, Guerrera, but she pronounced it Geta. And she moved like a song. With eyes bright like the dawn, light butter, pea complexion, full lips, I'm feeling her. And she international, she black Latin Brasilia. She got her head on straight, at least from conversation. She talked about education and relocation, just a tad bit shy. And it was quite refreshing with a subtle mystery that keeps me guessing. So I pursued respectfully with trepidation till we had our first date, full moon, pulsating. She in a situation, me, I'm in transition. So I'm candidly just stating my sincerest intention. It was to know her, show her how things could be. Moving to Florida shouldn't stop you from getting with me. Whether we friends or more, we at the framing store. Kicking it near and far, I do adore. Listen, I knew this girl was dope first time I scoped her. Trying to show her she and me could make we doper. So I polished my Tahuti talk, my Heru walk, my wedged eye on a borderline of stalking. I intrigued her mind with the clever talking. Next, I laid her out with the spirit massage. And after nine months of driving, pushed up in her garage like, Brr, oh my dear, hit first gear. Brr, hit reverse. Now that'll work. Brr, word is born, she turned me on. I just bugged out and laid upon the horn like, eh, eh, know what I'm saying? Like, eh. Er, yo, I ain't playing, but it feels like home. We in a real deep zone with a mutual connection like a two-way phone. We get to overstand, to understand, because understanding, outer standing is in high demand between black woman and man with they hand in hand. Pouring back on each other like time capsule sand. I gave her my name and we shared love's fame, but how I was ashamed when I gave her my pain unintentionally, but through mind expansion and time enhancing the sight of her pretty brown eyes, maritic dancing, she's got the purest pace, a curvaceous waist, and a distinctive little birthmark on the side of her face, with a caressing tone and a sensual touch, mm, damn she weighed past too much. Dig, but see, the best part that I'm learning is that I'm learning myself and herself as our worlds keep turning. See, proper balance with her, it will bring my eye. And proper balance with her cools down my heart. By Demo, the Supremo, that's what I got inadvertently <laughs> as I showered my car. Interpret me, because I met this towering star inadvertently, 
as she showered her car. Interpret me, because I met my lifelong friend when I reunited lives with my soulmate twin. And then she brought more love in my world because I came with three boys and then she gave me two girls. Now our family's complete day is our game, so may black love fall on y'all like rain. Hotep. Hotep. So that's Towering Star. We do it every year and we wanted to share it with y'all. 11th annual Coma Day. Mon Washa, Mon Show, and Nawasha <laughs> is Mon Washa Edu. Hotep. <laughs>